Is it already going? Yeah, yeah. Hey, tribe of fools. Um, this is Dracula. Long story short. This is the story of Dracula. So, there's this real estate agent named Jonathan. Jonathan's kind of a pansy. He's a pansy. This guy's an idiot. And Jonathan wanted to travel to Transylvania. Which sounds like tranny, which you know is going to be a big mess. And yeah, he tells his wife, Nina, goodbye. I want to peace out for a little bit. To close a real estate deal with someone named Count Dracula. Does some, uh, some horse and buggy riding, which is not so great. Almost attacked by wolves. Should have been a sign. Also, all of the people in the town going, don't go there. Please don't go, like you don't need to go, it's going to be scary and whatever. Dracula, no! He's a vampire. Vampire! Even if you don't know what that word means, it's it's kind of a turn away, turn away sign. And then he gets there, and he meets Count Dracula. Hello. You're kind of pale, and a little skinny. Wow, you're super ugly. But very nice, just, you know, kind-hearted, watches Oprah. So Dracula's like... Like, tons of random creepy shit starts happening. There are three crazy bride bitches. And of course, like, Dracula's like a pimp, because he's got, like, these three hoes that come in. Like, great expectations crazy. Um, there's some brides that show up, like, twice in the book. Um, and I think we're gonna show up more than that in this <laughs> version. I don't remember the whole story. Oh, you're so hot, Jonathan. And he's like, how do you know my name? And they're like, cause we're gonna eat ya. The bitches try to eat him. And Dracula goes, no, 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 ladies. The boy is mine. Dracula saves Jonathan. And then is like, here, I have a baby instead. Eat this baby. Get out while you can, Jonathan. And the next day he's like, I'm getting the fuck out. And climbs down the walls of a castle to escape. Like, it exhausts him. It exhausts him so much that we don't hear for him for another half of the book. Anyway. Meanwhile, back in the London ranch, Mina... How is she connected to Jonathan? Mina's good. Um, hanging out with her friend Lucy. I can't remember everything about her. It's like Nicole Richie and Paris Hilton a little bit, but like 400 years ago. So. And Lucy has like three men who want to marry her. I hate this bitch. So it's like, how dost thou? I dost good, booze it up. Okay, so then a ship just crashes into like the dock of the town that happens to have been rented out by A1 Mr. Dracula. You remember him, right? I don't remember right now. Terrible. And all that's found is is man who's dead with his hands uh, roped up and he's and he, uh, he's tied to the to the, the, the ship's wheel. After the ship crashes, Lucy starts sleepwalking. -na -na. Lucy sleepwalks, which is really fucked up and crazy. And her husband and their two buddies, they're friends now. They follow her to a graveyard where they find some man with glowing red eyes. Guy with red eyes. descends upon her and fucking attacks the shit out of her. So the doctor comes and goes, what do I do? Oh no. Uh, let me call my old teacher, Van Helsing. Oh, he said Fat Allison. <laughs> Van Helsing. No, Van Helsing. Who in my version is played by Hugh Jackman. Just saying. But nonetheless, uh, he explains what a vampire is and then he's like, we have to surround her with garlic. Um, and I think that, so that's where the whole garlic tradition came from. Lucy's mom doesn't know why the garlic's up. Why are they putting garlic all over the place? I super don't like this. It smells super bad. I'm gonna take this garlic down. And then a, a wolf busts in and not only attacks and kills Lucy, but uh, scares Lucy's mom so bad that apparently she has a heart attack. But then, I mean, this isn't even in the, sh in the show, I don't think, but... Um, he basically turns Lucy into a crazy vampire. So, Van Helsing and A, B, and C all team up and go, I think we should totally F her up. And so they fucking stick a stake through her heart, and when you think that's enough, they chop her head off and stuff her mouth with garlic. Like, just in case. It just seems excessive. Uh, Jonathan shows up. He resurfaced in Budapest. I don't know how the hell he got there. Um. He definitely had brain fever. 
I wasn't sure. Three. Van Helsing, the Doctor, A, B, and C. These people aren't in the show, so. These five are like, we're gonna team up and we're gonna destroy Dracula. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him, and we're gonna do it the same way we got Lucy. Oh, they all like study how to kill Dracula. Him and Mina, who are now married, team up with the five to form the Justice League. And somehow, like, Dracula has bitten Mina. Him, um, Jonathan, and a bunch of the other biddies are hiding away in this lovely little uh, insane asylum. They all think they're safe, and they're in this, like, cool stronghold from Dracula. And one night when they're all out doing research, um, some dude just lets Dracula in. His name is, like, Renfeld or something like that. He's, He's not in the show either. Anywho, um... And Dracula comes and fucking attacks Mina. This is really long. Um, and... So Mina's all, oh, I'm kind of a vampire now. So everyone goes to Transylvania. Because they have, like, an unlimited travel budget. And basically, uh... Jonathan and one of A, B, and C. And they kill him with knives. Kill Dracula with knives. That's basically the story, right? It's... Totally a cop out. It's an awesome good time because you know that's always what is great. Um, Was there anything else important? They like shanked Dracula. Um, then it's a happy little ending. Have you read the book? No, I haven't finished. <laughs> uh, I'm halfway through the book. And I think that's all the end. <laughs>